Hello, our travels have taken us to the desert. We're at the King Fahd Stadium in Riyadh. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It's Al Nasser and they take on Al Ain. I'm excited, Derek. Really looking forward to this game. Come on, bring it on. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4-5-1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Looks very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. This is how the visitors will set up today. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. And the match is underway. Al Sulahim. <laughs> Mohammed Abdul Rahman. What can he do from here? starters first goal of the game well here's the replay and the simplicity of the one two is there for all to see but then there's still plenty to do from here under all sorts of pressure from the defender he just about keeps him at bay and finishes with a plomb great goal So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Mike on. It's with Petros. Martinez. Abdul Majid al Sulahim. Mukhtar Ali. Here's Hamdala, and they have possession again. Mukhtar Ali. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Well, great read there to intercept. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Kojo Fodolaba. It's a weighted pass. How could he take them on and beat them? And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Martinez. Failed to keep hold of it.
Excellent passing. This looks promising. Mohamed Abdul Rahman. Oh, surely! Oh, a tremendous block. Petros. No chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Really vital interception. That's a lovely ball. No high quality defending. Wilson Eduardo. Mohamed Abdul Rahman. Alak Babi. Abdul Rahman. Can they get in behind them? Now well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Al Amri. Well read to win possession back. Making progress. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Wilson Eduardo. Mohamed Abdul Rahman. It's with Wilson Eduardo. Abdul Rahman. Well, can they open up the defence here? Mohamed Abdul Rahman. Abdul Rahman. Shiotani. Another perfect position to read it. Yahya. Abdul Majid Al Sulaim. Kim Jin Su. Hamdala. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Looks promising this. And now it's with Mukhtar Ali. Abdul Majid Al Sulaim. Al Amri. Al Sulaim. Fruitful looking attack. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, it's all about timing. You've got to wait for the ball to come down, and he's very, very unlucky. Laba Alak Babi Vital interception The danger was very real 
Al Sulahim. Petros. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. A glorious chance. A goal! Real excitement. A back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc, and he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. So, a level contest, 1-1. One, one. Fifteen minutes remaining. Shiotani. Mohamed Abdul Rahman. Bandar al -Akbabi. Can they grab the lead late on? Abdul Rahman. Keeping it moving dynamically. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Keeping the ball moving. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Abderazak Hamdala on the attack is there to be late drama Petros well, they'll be happy to have regained possession and only two minutes remaining here the referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order Kojo Fodolaba. What can he do from here? And he saw the situation developing. And the referee blows his whistle. Still all square after 90 minutes.